Hello everyone. Thank you for joining me. I will painting today something really easy things, but as coming the holiday season, a lot of customer will ask us to paint like snowflake or something like Christmas design and uh, this couple of week I will going through some basic designs which is mm, I'm pretty sure everybody can do however I just want a uh, share trick how you can uh, create quickly and uh, a simple things as a master uh, piece because uh, because no matter what you're painting the key is to get a beautiful pretty design is its proper uh, uh, line work all right so thank you for joining me hi everyone for example uh, the customer just usually ask oh just a simple French right pink and white that is for us is not a simple one the simple is the one color coating right and oh just couple snowflake is like eight or ten <laughs> you know what I mean and truly that is they don't know how that is work to and sometimes we just uh, we just cannot focus well or something so I want help because I personally I'm able to hand paint a lot of things however uh, if have to be something really straight or symmetrical I used a trick how will end up beautifully even if I'm not perfect so I teach you how you create perfect design even if when you started is not perfect yet all right I think that is powerful tricks because that is a snowflake but of course uh, any other design you can uh, adopt at the technique because uh, this kind of super sharp detail it's absolutely not an advanced level it's just have to be of course good material and brush which is thinner than the thinnest thinnest line right and some kind of trick what i will show to you guys and share with you and i hope the holiday season will be super busy so you will be fully loaded and uh, everybody will be so happy but sometimes i want uh, less stress to you during you do the designs okay so again it's basic things but what I will teaching and show every detail it will help to you no matter which kind of design you do and I use right now pink background because I really love uh, the Christmas design in pink colors because I personally don't really like the full red and green but I will do on blue too, so you can see is no matter which kind of color you used. And the plus, I will share with you how you can different kind of effect uh, creating, even if I used only one color, okay? Only one color, but at the end is a total different uh, design because the customer asking different kind of design. And I will just grab my glass. Oh, here we are. <laughs> because uh, I tell you, it's just last week I started using. So I will need the glass as the future. <laughs> I'm so goofy because I don't used to, right? So thank you for joining me. Hi, Elizabeth. <laughs> Hi to everyone. I don't see all uh, comments, so please uh, share. I share the hi with everyone, and I hope you have a wonderful day. So what I'm using as a background on that, you remember the beautiful ballerina collection. I have this nudie powdery pink. It's a little bit, it's just so amazing. So I used that as a background. <coughs> And uh, I only used for some from the gemstone collection, the 032 from the pure line, okay? So let's do, I start right now doing base, all right? And after, uh, I will start painting uh, simultan. So different 
design I were doing. I just take that one tip so you can see how it looks like. Maybe I take off that one because I want a pink background for sure. Mm. And even if you see that uh, uh, beautiful color, it looks like summery color, right? But if you add uh, like snowflake or any kind of winter design is already uh, give uh, the Christmas uh, color. Yes, actually the blue is the other one what I like in the Christmas. I I use the the tip uh, tip demonstration tip glue. It's totally transparent if you see right now because I already fixed on and it's super strong. I can take it off and doesn't left any residue or any kind of cheesy stuff. Even if I put into the uh, lamp and warming up, it doesn't mess up my tip. It's really important to me personally because it's so professional. I just change it and do. I don't waste the time to, you know, take out underneath and uh, just make super easy. Okay. That uh, glue as everything what I'm using is you can find on joans.com. Uh, you can see on the page, the Joans dot com <coughs> and uh, yes you can I answer just right now on the joins dot com I will try to pin <coughs> sorry so I applying right now the new ballerina color if you realized every time when I launch out the new collection I try to uh, using and working to give inspiration as an extra benefit uh, to my lawyer loyal, loyal uh, customers and I really love this color. <laughs> All right. So that is a little bit milky, but so easy to, that is a, a long tip. Okay, honey and C curved. So first I just applying a thin layer, like sliding layer. And after I try to gentle pull it down and let uh, self leveling. Okay. I put it into the lamp. It's already warm in my room, but if not so warm because I'm using EC, I let a couple seconds just outside from the lamp. So apply, wait 10 seconds, and after put into the lamp because you give time to, to uh, self-leveling because those, even the pure, even the color, it is 100% self-leveling, okay? So that is working to you too. So, Two painting snowflake have million kind of snowflake as a shape. Okay, so what I do strongly recommend just took screenshot and you can reproduce easily. Okay, I will share what is I really love that kind of uh, snowflake is so sophisticated. It's so special and I can do any size, any size. I will do a bigger right now especially uh, I want you to see how I do because to get this super detail especially three-dimensional and matte like silky if you touch you cannot touch but I touching and I tell ya okay that kind of silky uh, effect is just so elegant and so pop up no matter what uh, color you're using so to create what I strongly recommend don't forget it you buy it already the holy chrome right holy chrome and you 100 percent sure you already have the north flame zero one okay both are chrome that is flake version and that is a special effect because i really love the the effect what can you can do and the customer continuously will playing because it's just so good effect. I just wish, I just hope you guys see it through the effect. It's just nude, it's absolutely nude pink, but same times is like, you don't see is nude, but I tell you is light nude pink, that color actually. So right now it's cured. So I applying first the North flame. You know what? 
I just cheating. I don't do exactly that. Look, I using my sponge puff. I put it in the Picasso white, right? I tapping on my mixing sheet and I just add a cloudy white into just a cloudy don't need to be perfect just make more interesting more special okay okay something like that hmm. okay I put it into the lamp quickly why I'm do that because the north flame is fully transparent even if you see it's like amazing aurora borealis color so it's i don't know how many times changed the color i think it's eight i don't know that is from uk actually and I a different background will show totally different and because i add the cloudy white just simply using the sponge puffer tuk, 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 tuk. nothing don't spend time with that it's just like that and when i placing you will see will create totally different effect okay i just want to show if you already buy start using start using on any kind of background and if you just add the cloudy with black or white or, or really drastically or dramatically different color the reflection will be different okay and that too for holiday season honey it's essential one so she's out and right now, I have only just a, mm -hmm. a little bit, I, I don't wash it, okay? I wipe it off dark uh, uh, pigment, but never mind. So I just add on the surface. Tap, tap, tap. It's super, super thin, so if you need your nose is running honey go far away from that because it's f really really uh, thin uh, material this is why good because all what i'm doing today it's not need encapsulating it's simple just a gel polish application so you can use toenail or just uh, the quick manicure service okay i don't even add more i like as is not you know, a little bit okay you guys are same like me it's like oh i'm like talking by myself oh, a little bit more but sometimes you just have to stop because uh, overpowering if you just add too much i just add teeny tiny okay and i press on with my gloves because it's chrome, honey, that is not raised up at all, period. It will be laying down beautifully. And I will applying the effect base, which is kind of like a top, but keep uh, uh, securely any kind of chrome or any kind of effect material. Okay, so a thin layer because again i don't encapsulating that is just for the chroming actually we call it effect uh, base because because that is important underneath not on the top because that will fix the chrome on avoid to to chipping or peeling honey just like that is beautiful too to me it's like already a design but that is again just a black background that 30 seconds i will cure 30 seconds <coughs> you can thanks god if you not thanks god <laughs> th thanks for joining that is not sensitive if you forget it take out to the customer now and over cure like me 60 seconds okay that's okay okay because before i used the uh, the base for the chromes and i had good one but exactly on the time working well but after five seconds or 10 seconds is 
partially doesn't stack uh, on the, the chrome okay so that is uh, safely to use no matter what because you know sometimes customers just talking sometimes they're talking too much right so <clears throat> by this reason that is safely so i open it if someone doesn't see the holy chrome the holy chrome come in the uh, special collection so you can save money and get extra i wish i can show the reality but it's a really really special chrome okay is not have any same or similar it's total different super fine and take the cover pink to the amazing effect and on white and on any other color too i try to zoom in but after i have to zoom back because uh, uh, when i painting you will lose the zoom and you don't see just my gloves for uh, for wedding season is good too yeah actually i tell you those bibs is not just only for um, for holiday season that is just something what really i do recommend if you don't have yet it's must have if you have don't uh, hide it in the drawer because that is save your ass if someone wants something special every color you can change with them it's just so cool so so she's out and i'm just using my gloves this quantity okay and they're just rubbing on the surface and did you see how big quantity i'm used it's wholly nothing because this is how super uh, powerful chrome okay and they did kind of like ombre okay just right now you you cannot recognize what happened before it's just like make something oh when i working on the nail okay <laughs> yeah it's uh i tried the best but truly really every time when we zoom in uh, because I, i'm moving right the highest point got the zoom from the camera so by this reason if so close uh unfortunately uh will uh you you will see less but anyway every live video you can see in the past too i recorded and i posted it on the youtube so if you uh, uh, following or subscribe to the YouTube channel you can uh, send to the smart TV and watch on your flat TV so that mean honey you will see every mistake what I do <laughs> okay that is what I recommend right now you just try to focus uh, it's visible okay will be visible everything but focus on uh, more of the information what I try to uh, share so first I will do uh, that kind of uh, the snowflake that is my favorite have million kind of snowflake just take screenshot even if you go to the grocery and you see on somewhere a snowflake screenshot it okay that is more like a little bit baroque or romantic version and uh, and super easy so I just want to show how and I can teach how you can micro uh, painting with the perfect line <coughs> so the first but I strongly do recommend how doing the cross on balanced and harmonically uh, same shape or that is just not easy okay so what I do recommend do not make a fall immediately okay I show what I what I mean so I'm using I just take it out okay the Picasso white Oh, already too much, whatever. And mm -mm, I I have to right now coating right now, okay? 
because I forget it, uh, I just chrome it and I need the top shine. When I will painting with the Picasso on the surface, make sure you don't over cure, okay? Don't over cure. That means how the top shine, the pure one and uh, the colorate one is cure under 60 seconds on the dual source lamp <coughs> and 120 on the uh, UV, but I think no one use anymore. Uh, that mean halfway you have to stop that mean it's shiny okay already but the gel will cure inside the top shine this way the customer will not lose the design okay so do not over cure it or do not make full cure okay oh my god guys that is more better with the white background. Isn't it? Look. It just gave more, more sexy. <laughs> it's more special. So I put in the, to the lamp for 30 seconds only. And I put into the gel, into the gel and rolling and pull it out and rolling. I show how I, if you see the, the, the logo, the logo, if you see, you see I'm rolling, right? Rolling back because I want how teeny tiny quantity have inside the brush, but still, still no ball on or no excess. If I want a thicker, starting and I pulling to thinner line I just put back the end to create a little bit excess uh, material okay because I will sometimes this way sometimes I other way okay so doing like a cross is not easy so first I put the dot okay I already see in the center or not because if not a center you can wipe it off immediately okay so touch down here is thicker and pull it okay turn around and yes customer nails this way right i try to show but she can do this way too same as we doing right so i will back and i try put the dot okay because this point I can see in the center or same distance as I want touch down and pull it to the center okay okay next because that is bigger than uh, this distance so the far away as you can like this and just pull it Okay, right now I have chance to wipe it off any of them if it's not symmetrical. If you feel not confident, just right now you have the line, so just touch down like this a little bit, you see? And that little line will help because when you turn this direction, you don't see that line already. That makes sense? So by this reason, I just touch down to marking and that marking line will help me to see where the hell I am and <laughs> where I have to put the next one and if I turn this way I already see the mark so I can I got more chance to to create a perfect without messed up <coughs> Okay, next one. Of course, we need this direction and this direction. You never pull it across uh, the whole line. Because, first of all, I want here is thicker and the center is thinner. Here is thicker, center is thinner. Second, it's, don't forget it, the, the customer nail is three-dimensional. Okay, maybe not this three because it's a long and extreme 3D, but have is not flat so to make one line i have to start it this way 
pull it and look my hand and turn around this way. Honey, you cannot do that. I cannot do that. So every time you stop your stroke and adjust. So that is too much. Touch down and pull it. The next one is the opposite. Touch down and pull it. Touch down and pull it. This point is help to me how I have to cut halfway this create this tri two triangle. That makes sense? So the half is the point and just pull it to the center. Okay, so here is the big triangle. I have to do cutting to half. So I just pulling like that. Okay. If is not a perfect is not a problem. Okay, but have to be symmetrical and have to be the that inside line is super thin and the other rules honey believe me believe me lines never touch each other because that beautiful thin line if i touch the second one and third one already will be thick fat line okay so and i start to make like little bit romantic version of the snowflake so little ball i start a little bit lower and a little bit left okay touch down and pull it and curve to the center when i coming to the center is almost zero the quantity okay other every time i do the other one Curving to zero. If you see under microscope, is the isn't touch the two line, okay? And I will do more and more, but every time left side, then the right side, and left side, and the right side. Why are I doing? Because it's hand painting, honey, okay? We are not machines. You cannot make beautifully exactly the same, but if one is bigger, I have a chance to correct it with the next one to fill out or add more to the uh, that makes sense if i finish this and after i'm going start this it's so difficult to make exactly same as i did in the upstairs right so by this reason because i believe in myself curving to the center line but don't cross the center line do not cross Okay. okay here i started where is ended because you remember that here is not same space so i just pulling like this and you have to understand how on the customer nail we sometimes adjust the design because it's just different length different wideness so Sometimes we're just chilling, but harmonically have to be balanced. Okay? So this way, even if all is different, at the end will be looks like same. Okay? That is the key. So again, a more smaller because I'm coming closer to the center and believe me will be less, 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 less space. So more closer. I continue one and two. One and two. One. Mm -hmm. I every time I pick up a little dot. This is what you see. I go back and go back and go back. Okay. The whole brush surface I don't touch back to the gel again because already loaded. Okie dokie. So 
don't even adjust the thickness yet because I told you I build up and when I see it's, oh it's good I don't mess up after I used to make bigger because if not symmetrical to make wider that one I can cheating to make widening that side or this side okay so I do a little bit different why not mm -hmm. I pull it one from here and I pull it one from here I always curving that one because it's just more stylish I'm doing right now super slow and uh, explaining the detail because it's super easy but that kind of small information it will oh I don't finish that side right so I just pull it this one too I just forget it too much talking too much talking but anyway I just finish right now so I always curving that make more fancy and uh, as you see the mi micro micro ball it's almost maybe invisible on the camera but if you see with your naked eye or with your glass it have a little excess at the end and always I pick up this little excess that before I touch down okie dokie right now I already see oh thanks god I don't messed up yet <laughs> so by this reason I just make more widening that one right side left side just gentle pull it already have material on my brush and on the 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 tips too for example that line it's have more closer to the center than this one that makes sense so by this reason I just correcting to make widening this side to make more closer doesn't have to be match or same but this is why I don't paint ahead because this point I just can't a little bit adjusting okay okay I go underneath okay it's same this is more down and this is curved to more closer so I widening a little bit that direction the right side widening make this curvy shape more to the right my right I mean maybe a camera for you guys is left but you know what I mean so this way you see and already got more balanced beautiful mm -hmm. <coughs> the finest and the perfect line brush is totally different is not everybody thinking is just the size important no the hair all brushes from Joann's is handmade and made uh, to me exclusively and the synthetic hair is different between the two so if I want nice curving and pulling at this kind of design always I'm using the perfect line if I want like a little curvy line or roses or something it's more easy with the finest because that is more firmer both is super special pointed sharpie pointed and thin brush but because we don't buy the brush and <laughs> labeled and sell to you that is made to us and uh, it's special so uh, always when I do this kind of design so longer and thin and and curving like like really gentle I always using the perfect line 
okay where I am so I do here is I cannot finish right because the customer hand is here so end up here so I just do wide widening a little bit because the color even if you don't see the end but the white I have to see the white same as on the upper on the lower uh, part I add a little bit here and I finishing it in the camera because I'm on the zoom it looks like so big but I tell you I will show something to see uh, the difference is so so thin lines really really thin so again I just adjusting here too to make balanced and I just want to see back again the extra white same as upper or lower uh, level have okshi dokshi so right now I just add extra detail the dot from here and quick pull that from here and quick pull Pull me not a swimming pool. Pull means pull, pull it quickly. Because this way I don't give enough time to the gel to uh, stay loading down to the tip. This is why I do a little drop shape. Touch down and quick pull it. I do the horse eye shape in the center to make more complex. Every time I do the opposite side because you will forget it and uh, and you have a chance to change if you don't like it. Mm -hmm. Horse eye. Or you know what I mean this shape something like that I think it's horse eye shape <laughs> or we just call from now horse eye shape <laughs> inside <coughs> and inside you see I just filled up the center inside inside did you ever imagine how easy to make this kind of lacy perfect detail and honey is nothing special what I drawing right now the special how I take seriously when I'm using the brush so never overload it what I see mostly even if I don't see how they doing I just see the end of the design and they realized they just messed up only because they pick up too much material maybe if it doesn't cover it well your material doesn't even able to pull it use different gel simple but don't use too much have to be full coverage for this kind of uh, drawing and of course the brush have to be thinner than the line what you want drawing right so pull it and pull it okay right now the center is really detailed okay what I looking for is every time I do different here is empty it's freaking empty okay so I have to do something first I for sure I will pull it this direction to make balanced with that mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
I hope everybody have uh, a wonderful day. I tell you, today is an amazing day. If you don't feel that, honey, because your amazing day will be tomorrow. I promise, okay? <laughs> I'm just happy always. And people asking why I'm so happy always. Because I, I decide to be. I don't care. It doesn't mean every day is happen amazing things with me. No, honey, it's not. I just, first of all, when I wake up, I realized, wow, I got one more day, okay? I can, again, mess up something or do amazing things, right? So I do recommend every time thinking of that. Second, because I'm able to doing art. Art make my soul charging always. So that I strongly recommend anytime when you have chance to painting, canvas, uh, nail art, whatever, your room. Honey, every room is a big canvas or just painting on any kind of egg or whatever because that is just makes me happy I think it's pretty cool mm, yeah I don't want overthinking okay it's, it's already pretty cool so what else I do hi everyone hi if you just joining us I just painting super uh, thin uh, detail work this is a little bit on the big zoom but that's okay because you can see but we make something like that but always I change something so that is a little bit different oh you know what I change one more things what about if I filled with white in this little horse eye shape huh what do you think do you want me to feel? Yeah, because it will be more whiter. Please don't forget it. Uh, that is super pigmented, the Picasso. So don't load it with too much material. Even if, because I'm on zoom, super zoom. Even if you feel like it's a big quantity, honey, it's not. It's like the size, like a little mosquito legs on the legs the toenail and if you're painting on her toenail okay this teeny tiny quantity is just nothing I just touch it and pull it I just decide that because maybe I add Swarovski to in the center because this customer will pay enough if not uh-uh honey uh-uh but I just want to show different uh, design, not just a sample. And this is how easy, if you have good brush and good material, and you can paint anything what you want. Anything. Everything. Or whatever, you know what I mean. I, 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 I already know before I started this video how I don't drink the afternoon coffee you know the big cup of coffee the cappuccino one with a beautiful rich foam on the top and I just realized that and after that I just I'm not able to thinking of anything else right now it's just I already see my cup in my mind which is gray from Starbucks actually it's an oversized cup mmm you know what? When I finish, I will do that. I don't care. It's night. Honey, if I drink coffee before I go to the bed, even if I do that, I will sleeping like a sleeping beauty. Just I don't wake up beauty. Whatever. So, touch it and a little bit pull it. Gentle. You see? I feel with white is more, more, more nicer. Especially if you add the Swarovski because already bling bling the whole nail you have to add uh, More white to get contrast That makes sense because it's too much bling bling the Swarovski will not pop up Voila <coughs> So I'm using 
the acrylic powder which is the crystal clear and you can use any kind of acrylic powder just make sure it's extremely fine okay if something like jar like a dollar that is not the one i tell you i try to have okay so good quality extreme fine the builder uh, acrylic powder from joanne's is super extremely fine like a baby powder okay i'm using the little uh, triangle tree which is come in the four set because sometimes i like the back especially swarovski because easy to find and sometimes uh, between uh, the ca uh, customer you use multiple time different material and you don't have to time to wash so it's just it's just this is why we have a set of four so i'm using the actually i'm using right now the white one because mostly uh, you see i'm using this one because that is enough but right now is wide enough so i want to make sure one side other side and the center okay i see if you see it shining back you have to pour one more time nope perfect go into the lamp as is don't take off the dust yet so the customer going with the powder on the into the lamp okay that quantity what i'm using honey that is nothing okay please throw away don't forget it even if you do disinfection on her skin okay she's sweating honey i don't want got no one sweating i love you guys but <laughs> we don't have to share sweaty stuff okay so hygienically not just for the inspector of the salon your customer and if your customer see you are you are professional you acting like pro she never we are thinking you do anything wrong on her even if we sometimes do boo boo okay so by this reason little tricks uh, just believe me it doesn't pay it off that teeny tiny scoop is nothing customer will pay for the design and this is how you have to working uh, don't use <laughs> pull back or deep no no honey i love you but better i promise we never be sweating together because i just know not you know what i mean mm -mm. but you know what i mean what i'm talking about other things always wash cleaning wipe off the every two what are you using because if not you will touch the the table and a lot of things and messed up everything so the bluish it's transparent honey i'm using only that one the clips are clear you know why i don't using black and nude and whatever colors because the gel polish or gel is developed to cure as is okay if i'm drawing with the uh, black uh, gel polish okay i drawing design with black gel polish the biggest mistake if you use black acrylic powder on because that was developed to full cure as is not with extra black pigment the black acrylic included black pigment which which uh, doesn't let penetrate the light to uh, curing through to the bottom okay that makes sense always use the clear because chemically okay both but will the light will never going through and even if stay on the customer nail when she pay maybe one week later just come off and you tell it oh you did something and she don't remember i tell you isn't cured underneath and the worst things the under cured or not cured gel is raw chemical okay even if super good material especially if you come from sites you know what i mean which is not from united states you they can do or you can developing allergy most of the allergies not most 99.9 .9 per person 
is anchor gel or wiping the gel surface off whatever so please avoid to do that use only clear because this way we are curing to uh, through beautifully so the blue one for example that is uh, the beautiful summer color however i can use as beautiful winter blue light blue okay that is from the summer collection that is the hypoallergenic uh, pure you remember have different color of the pure have for example the macaron which is milky like kind of see through and that is the full coverage let couple second to self leveling all right look at that beautiful self leveled go into the lamp to cure and i show you something show you something what helped to someone who who working on the salon and some customer des uh, deser uh, deserve to make hand painting and you enjoy the company because uh, you love she is with you but some customer is just as soon as possible she want to leave or you want her leave or she just coming late but she have to go running earlier so you don't have the time what you scheduled for her that makes sense so sometimes we don't have a time okay but you want do beautifulness okay i want to introduce something to you that honey that is save your pretty ass because <laughs> i don't like stickers i don't like too much stickers especially i had in my life only one customer i let her out of my salon the reason was because i scrubbed the beautiful nail and she forced me to stuck on the nail a sticker what she bring with her bag okay and that is okay too but that was so gross <laughs> it's like really terrible sticker so maybe that customer make me never use sticker but right now i'm using a lot of sticker because i picking or i ordering the sticker the best one okay so that is again i i picked from uh, the japanese artist look at that look at that gorgeous babe honey everybody ass is pretty okay now, look at that i just answered to the questions <laughs> a gentle holographic super detail actually that is good to copy if you want copying okay now that is really must have in the holiday season <laughs> because it's beautiful okay look at that i just don't paint it <laughs> i just add extra okay <clears throat> so what i'm doing i'm using right now the ruber base one zero one from the pure I applying to here oh that is the purple of the summer collection I just show how all color what I created to you guys is <laughs> actually good on any season okay and I just put uh, the the silver on so she's in the lamp the blue is out I add a rubber base Maybe on the other tip I apply too much because I just focus on the beautiful <laughs> shininess. So don't use too much. Not necessary. Don't waste your money, honey. Okay. And I just remove the dust. Usually I just remove my gloves. On the customer you can put uh, the paper towel. Mm -hmm. So here we are. It's just amazing effect underneath is like looks like multi-dimensional and just cute and matte and i tell you if she touch is like uh, i don't know which kind of material is not rough it's like so smooth but same time 
is like uh, not even texture is like super smooth and matte and holy chrome and the north flame and you remember i just do tack 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 underneath because the north flame is show million phase depending on the background and depending on the angle so let's gorgeous come back so i will add oh sorry so that is the art sticker 58 okay it's just i tell you it's just really something like you really need and the plus you can cut it half if you you <laughs> want to save money <laughs> no i'm just joking no if the surface is too small or whatever okay mm -hmm -hmm. so which one i applying i applying that one if you use uh, to take off any kind of sticker you know sometimes you pick up and you lose the half or whatever use the meta tool you already have i'm 100 percent sure because you cannot i i cannot survive without my metal tool okay that is for uh, pushing back the cuticle that is for dotting that is micro dotting and that is for take off the the stickers and you see mm, 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 that one so for example here have one two three okay if I pull it from this angle, if I just start one, easily can broke anywhere because it's super thin. In the joints that come, you will buy just super thin sticker, not the cheap one, okay, honey? It's cheap, but it's good quality. Every I item I tested, okay? Because I hate the sticker that you cannot lay down on the nail, right? Because the sticker for, for children's or whatever. So one, two and re uh, elevate the third one too. And right now I'm just going underneath, uh, stuck on my, uh, on my metal tool with my finger and pull it out, okay? I know maybe everybody know, but when I was young, I was no chance to someone show me that one. Okay, okay. Um. I press down really, really well. And use the top coat. It's difficult because it's super shiny with the silver too. First I use just a simple the top coat and I will add back the mat. Mm -hmm. <coughs> so on this one, mm -hmm. I will add something holographic, that one, so one, two, and three i'm going underneath press to the metal tool and take it off uh -oh. press down press down press down mm -hmm. okay i hope i use the top shine on the other tip because right now I see both is open and they're just talking like a silly girl. Do you guys happen that? <laughs> Have two bottles open and just apply the, whatever, let's see. I will figure it out quickly. No, it was top shine. Okay, here we are. And I add the mat because I wanna see the purple again. And I add the matte top coat because on this uh, quantity of the silver is just freaking too much to me. I applied because I want a matte. With matte, beautiful. But for me, it's just too shiny. Uh, 
Okay. Mm -hmm. And I just add like a necklace back. Continue that, 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 that. Super thin. Every time it's smaller, 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 smaller. Line. Mm -hmm. And that, that, that. Bigger that. Smaller. Smaller, smaller, smaller. bigger, smaller, 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 just like that, like something cutie, you know what, just here, that, 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 to make balanced, okay, it's just a simple, how I use the metal tool too, <coughs> so here we are, you can painting beautifully, or you can just simple, got the essential <laughs> sticker set okay don't forget it yes i am saving always my live video because i i don't picking i want to share just only one person i want to help to everyone and sometimes we just watching or i talking silly or whatever or just reading the questions and you don't remember so always you can watch back okay a lot of video i have please don't forget it uh, if you don't subscribe yet subscribe it especially i will start really soon doing uh, videos just only on the youtube for subscribers and if you like it give me thumb <laughs> and on the uh, note section you can communicate with me on the youtube always and exclusively i will answering to you really i'm really quick uh, uh usually a couple hour uh, i'm i'm able to answer and uh, i help you guys uh, no matter what you have a question no bad question or no, uh, any question is uh, good because not only you thinking of that believe me a uh, lot of other uh, nail technician uh, thinking of that just they not brave enough to ask so asking is power okay because you will get the answer uh, any product that I'm using uh, is available exclusively only on joans.com. That is the official and uh, the website. And uh, I hope have a wonderful um, Thursday and see. Oh, guys, I tell you, Saturday I will show something really, really money saver and time saver in the salon life. I can't wait to share with you. It's small things, but that unfortunately doesn't have in the market uh, when I working a lot of the salon. Thank you, Elizabeth, you, you posted. Yes, www.joans.com. So this Saturday, I will show small things, cheap things, and big money saver in the salon. If you're working in the salon, and you're filing too much and you <coughs> you waste too much time to shaping la 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 i will uh, show you something what really really <coughs> helpful so have a wonderful thursday see you on um, saturday and don't forget it guys love each other and tag me if you make any uh, this kind of uh, design what i teach to you i love you ciao